Scotty Kilma. Oh no, you didn't. <laughs> know this guy right he talks about cars he's like the most negative auto mechanic on the planet today we're replacing this mirror with this mirror because this mirror is broken so it's junk 2016 Ford Explorer is a junk the reason why it's junk is the person who went through the Wendy's drive-thru hit the speaker it's junk now that the mirror is off it's junk Ford Explorer mirrors are junk <laughs> this is why you don't buy a Ford Explorer mirror I have to put a new mirror on, and this is just garbage. Plug the stupid thing back in. Put the junk cover back on. Never buy a Ford Explorer, the complete junk. All right, first of all, Scotty, you're old. Old as dirt. And I understand your old school methods, but come on, man. You put a tripod in front of a car, and you do interviews with yourself in public. And you go like this all the time. Like you're, like you're throwing suitcases in the air. People must drive by you and go, what is wrong with that guy? You look like Donald Trump, Mr. Mackey Jr. from South Park, and Ozzy Osbourne had a three-way. And you were the offspring. And man, you were so negative. And I used to watch your videos. They were funny. And this old guy, this guy's old. He's got a whispery voice. He talks about cars. He's kind of funny. I enjoyed your video until one day, you decided to make a video about a Dodge Ram. How Dodge Ram trucks suck. And the Ram is the worst truck to get? Ram is the worst truck ever? Oh, it's on, baby. It's on. Ram is the worst pickup truck? Are you all right, guy? Dodge Ram is the worst truck. What? See, once I saw that video, you know, I gave it a thumbs down because I had to, obviously. You, you made, you're making the wires touch up my head. And oh, Dodge Rams have so many recalls. Buddy, I got news for you. Look up GM, Chevy, Ford. Millions of recalls, they all do. <laughs> Every time I laugh, I'm gonna put a picture of a mouse or a cat or a dog or a goat laughing. Every time I laugh, you're gonna see an animal laughing. <laughs> Funny, Rams are the worst truck ever. They're the worst truck ever. But your favorite engine is a Hellcat engine, which is a Hemi. What? Yeah, the Hellcat's the best engine. I saw your video, Scotty. It's the best engine. The, the Hellcat engine is the best. It's a Hemi engine, which is in 90% of Dodge Rams. In all these videos of how to spot a scam, a scam dealership, a scam mechanic, buddy, you're the scam. You contradict yourself just about every other video. Never buy an old car. Never buy a used car. Never buy a new car. What am I supposed to buy, Scotty? Am I supposed to just steal one? That would make a great video, wouldn't it? Don't buy this, don't do this, don't, 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 can't, junk, crap, miss the negative, man. Wicked negative. Well, I'm gonna make a video on a, uh, which oil, which oil is the best, which oil is the worst. And you have a picture of Mobile One, which I happen to use in my truck. I've been using it just about forever, full synthetic. And after watching the video, you don't even have an answer. It was like the most misled information you could possibly give on oil. You might as well talk about extra virgin olive oil, if that's the case, but I know you're not Italian. I mean, are you even into performance? Dodge Rams don't last. They don't last 100,000 miles. Everything breaks. You got a video of a Ram, 100 some odd thousand miles and the starter goes. Acting like a donkey trying to figure it out. Uh, putting a hammer to it. And then you replace it with an AutoZone starter. Then after you're done, you turn it over and it sounds like the damn engine's missing push rods. Obviously that truck was a piece of junk because whoever owned it treated it like a piece of junk. <laughs> <laughs> so I've owned an 03 Dodge Ram up to about 85,000 miles, no problems at all. Drove it like I stole it just about every day. 2015 Dodge Ram with a Pro Charger at seven pounds of boost. Six inch lift 35s, no problems at all. And a 2017 Dodge Ram uh, Crew Cab 1500. Laramie. To say that Dodge Rams are junk and the worst truck ever is just is just playing crazy. As you know, tune Rams. We, we have a lot of people who are breaking world records. <laughs> Woo! I have test driven Chevys. I've test driven Fords. Dodge Ram is quite possibly the most comfortable truck you will ever drive in. I, I'll fall asleep in this seat if I go too far. It's so comfortable. Plenty of power, obviously, from your favorite engine, the Hemi. 
it turns heads. People always want to mess with you because the truck's just plain sick. I mean, the only reason why you got a lot of likes of that video is because you have a lot of Chevy and Ford lovers. And man, do you love Toyotas. You love Toyotas. You don't like the Toyota dealership, but you like the Toyotas. Ragging on a ramp because they got bought out by Fiat and a bunch of Italians who don't know how to work on cars. Are you kidding me? You ever heard of the Ferrari? Hand-built Ferrari? And you can't just buy one. You have to you have to deserve one. Italians can't work on cars, but Toyota's just a way better car. That Camry. Woo! What's your Camry get in the quarter mile? This 6,000 pound truck did 12 seconds. 1291 in the quarter mile. But it's a piece of junk. I mean, look at this thing. It's all leather everywhere. Junk. Look at this. Garbage. This thing is just complete garbage. Oh, something broke. It's complete junk. This this broke too. That must be a scam. Dodge Ram, the Ram, the newer Rams are quite possibly the best pickup truck you can buy. Comfortable, fast, awesome towing capacity. Everyone that has come in my truck has sit in the front or the back, says how comfortable it is, it's beautiful. Man, I wish I could go around and just go to people's cars, set up a tripod and talk to myself. You're so old school, you don't even know how to do a selfie. I mean, Scotty, we really gotta sit your old ass into a nice, fast Hemi. And I mean, look up Kodoto Racing, the world's fastest Hemi powered Dodge Ram in the world. <laughs> I mean, they're just junk, you know? A six second Dodge Ram must be a piece of junk. I could sit you in eight second Rams, nine second Rams, 10 second Rams, 11, 12. I mean, reliable Rams. And most of the 10 second and 11 second Rams are daily drivers. I can make a list of 30 to 40 Rams that you would enjoy driving in, that you think are junk, but will put your old ass behind the seat, sit you back and watch you turn. Then I'll have to clean it up off my leather. I'll have to recommend going to CVS to get you a Depends diaper because you know what's gonna happen again. Come on, Scotty. Calm down. Stop being so negative. Ease up with the coffee. <laughs> Stop waving your hands or everyone's gonna think you're Italian. I challenge you, Scotty, to go to your dealership and buy a 2019 Dodge Ram 1500. Drive it around and then make a video on it. Try to find junk on that. All right, Scotty Kilmer. Good laugh. Keep up the great videos. <laughs> I'm about to race a Toyota Tundra and smoke his ass. Because we know you love Toyotas. Later!